What up dudes? So today I'm doing another catch and cook. Now I've done one of these in a long time and I'm going out to target an extremely underrated species. It's something that you kind of just overlook, man. I'm gonna take it home, I'm gonna cook it up and it's gonna be delicious. All right, first cast right here. It's probably not gonna take very long for me to catch the target species. I'm feeling pretty confident. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. What do you guys think? Do y'all know what the target species is yet? Come on, fish, man. I have not had a bite yet. Oh, there's a bite, there's a bite, there's a bite. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Oh, dude, that's a nice fish. That's a good one, come here. First cast, I think I've got our target species. No, it's not. Oh my God. It's a pig fish. I was going for a croaker and it's a pig fish. All right, let's give it another shot here. Uh, I'm going for a croaker, guys. I am going for a croaker, not a pig fish. I've already eaten pig fish and they're terrible. I do not like them at all. They're like one of the worst tasting fish ever and I'm never gonna eat one again. I have not eaten a croaker since I was a kid, man, but they're phenomenal to eat. They're a great fish. I'm gonna show you guys today what I'm talking about here. So I figured out my problem. I wasn't using the micro pole with four pound test. I wasn't getting any bites, man. They were not biting it. All right, dudes, I got one. I got fish on, fish on, fish on right here. This could be him, I don't know. First cast with the mini rod and four pound test. What are we working with, baby? What are we working with? Oh my God, are you kidding me? Check this out, dudes. The worst species I can possibly catch right here. A hardhead catfish. That's a big fat whammy. From now on, no whammies. <clears throat> that was awful. It's like the most hated species known to man right there. So I'm gonna be honest with you, right now, I don't know if we're gonna be eating any croaker. My line just broke on that four pound test. Broke on a rock, so I'm going back to the big pole. I moved it down just a little bit here, guys. I wasn't getting any bites at the normal spot, so we're gonna see if there's anything right here. Oh, there he is. I moved down, oh, that, uh, oh dude, it's a croaker. Look at there, that's a croaker. That's croaker number one, check it out. Check it out. So that, my friends, is a croaker. Now, I had to move down just a little bit to find these guys because they weren't in their normal spot. Uh, second cast at this new spot, we got us a croaker. He's a small one, but he's gonna fry up nice. I'd like to get three or four more of these guys just to have enough to eat. Let's see if that was a fluke or if there's actually a school of croakers right here. There he is, boys. I got something coming in here. I'm not sure what. There's another one, same spot. Oh, look at there. That's funny. There's a black drum. Come here. There's a black drum. Oh my God, he broke my line. I had that four pound test on and he broke it. I probably should have netted that guy. I forgot that I put a four pound test leader on this big pole and I was putting too much pressure on him for that black drum. He just picked up this piece of squid, man. I think I got number two on here, boys. That's what it looks like anyway. Yep, croaker number two. There he is. Catch one or two more, we're going to the house and start cooking. Right here, dude. That's the target species, croaker number two. Found the croaker hole. Listen to him. Oh, oh, he's taking it. Come on, take it all the way, man. All right, croaker number three coming up here right now. I think it's a croaker. Yeah, it's a croaker. It's a croaker. Hell yeah. Awesome. There he is. We're we going to have a fried croaker lunch today. What do y'all think about that? Everybody's invited. See if we can get us another one real quick. We're getting a bite. 
we're definitely getting a bite he's on there there he is there he is come here buddy come here buddy boom croaker we have found the honey hole baby we have found it so that was fun guys man sometimes it's fun to get out by yourself like that do some do a little light tackle non-serious fishing all right i'm done yapping i'm going to the cook all right so let's get started cooking these guys and since they're small croakers what I'm gonna do is cook them whole. Now, I love cooking small fish whole. It's one of my favorite things to do. And what I'm gonna do first is I'm just gonna scale these guys with the back of my fillet knife. And I just use the back of my fillet knife, run it over them real quick and make sure to scale them good. You don't wanna be eating those scales. And then after that, I'm gonna gut it and just scale it and gut it and that's all you have to do. And then you wanna, after you gut it, you wanna start kind of trying to prep it. Okay, and so you're gonna cut slices down the side of the fish, just like this, three slices down the side, one slice the full length of his body. And what this does is kind of opens up the fish to be able to seize it. So I've got the fish right here, and I'm just gonna go pretty basic with these guys, just some salt and pepper on each side. I like heavy seasoning with fish though, so I'm gonna go heavy with the salt and pepper, and then I'm just gonna flour. And after I flour this fish, it's gonna be ready for the frying pan. So I'm gonna throw it in the frying pan right here. That's been heating up, and we're gonna cook it till it's golden brown, and then we got us some fried croca. dudes it's time to try some croaker now i haven't never tried croaker on this channel i have eaten croaker before so i know it's going to be good if i would have caught them a little bigger i would have probably filleted them like a normal fish but these dudes are so small that uh i'm just going to eat them whole man i love cooking fish whole too man you get a lot of meat off of them that way here goes man whole fried croaker in the house So I'm gonna give you my thoughts on the croaker, man. It was absolutely just as I expected, super sweet tasting meat. I mean, one of the sweetest tasting meats that you will find on a fish. I can understand why the big trout love them and all the other big game fish like that, because they're awesome. I mean, dude, that was really, really good. I'd love to have a whole mess of those croakers just to fry up because it's so tasty. I just did that super quick. Like I said, fried it whole. I'm gonna eat the rest of these because they're so good. I do this because there are so many fish out there that you could target, but people just pass over. Why couldn't you go catch 20 croakers? You know, people complain about the limits. Why couldn't you just go catch 20 croakers and come back to the house and have a feast? If all you're wanting to do is fish for food because people complain about the limit so much. I've eaten everything that swims out there and most of it tastes good. So why are you complaining about the fish limits when there's plenty of good tasting fish out there that you could be eating? So that concludes today's video. It was just a quick catch and cook episode. I've got another catch and cook plan for you, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to go through with it. I don't know, man. Ugh, I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting sick just thinking about it. Comment below to see if you can guess what species I'm going to do a catch and cook video with probably later on this week. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, shoot me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. You guys have a great week.